are a global destination. Our difficulties over the last few years should not constrain our ambition and should not cause us to feel that we cannot make it again. And, and I want to say something because this morning I met with the Director General of PAHO. It's ironic that the current Minister of Tourism also served time as Minister of Health. And they will tell you that Barbados, <laughs> we are who we are. And I say so in a way that perhaps I need to explain. Because others make assumptions without understanding that sharing the burden and sharing the bounty means understanding who we are and accepting it. This is the country on 166 square miles that has had a greater density of population than most. And that doesn't mean we're not underpopulated, but we've had a greater density of most than most. This is a country from the cholera epidemic in the 19th century that has always understood that a public health crisis can decimate this population. And therefore, the worst thing that could have happened to us is the pandemic. Why? Because instinctively, Barbadians value public health and health almost at the same way they value education. Because they understand that people live cheek by jowl in many districts in this country. Which is why, in spite of the large population that we have, we have large tracts of green um, landscape la, uh, in the country, landscape, a bucolic countryside. What does that mean? That our neighbors were able, and easier so, to make decisions that we as a population and as a government did not make because we understood that we had to carry our people with us in terms of their comfort levels in managing this pandemic. Having done that, we are now at a stage where we are now fitter than most. And if we are fitter than most, we must now run faster than most. And I trust and pray that all Barbadians from every walk of life will understand truly that tourism is our business, that we have now to be able to do that which is necessary in order to help pay the bills and improve the quality of life of our people, while at the same time giving people an experience of their lives.